Hello. Today I'd like to talk to you on the subject of organs. Organs are a fascinating topic for both young and old alike. And even if you feel you fit into neither of these simple categories, do please like the best organs. Stay tuned. Organs. <coughs> well, where do you begin? I'm going to begin now. Organs are a fascinating topic for both young and old alike. This is partly due to their size. And my God, they can be huge. Do they build small organs, you ask? Not on your nelly, I reply indignantly. Only big ones. This is what makes them so fascinating to both fat and thin alike. The most important part of any modern organ is the pipe. A pipes can come in many sizes, of course. Some are just bloody enormous. My God, are they big. Some pipes are so big, if you laid them on their side in Piccadilly Circus, they'd look like... They'd look... They'd look like I don't know what. And other pipes are absolutely minute. Teeny, weeny, weeny, weeny little things. Some of them. Why, I've seen pipes so small, you can't see them. I haven't seen pipes so small, you can't see them. They're so small. And size is a very important facet of modern organ construction. This is because small pipes play high notes and big pipes play low notes. And in the, in the construction of the organ, it is clearly crucial to place the pipes in the right order. Otherwise, anything could happen. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Do, 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 do. <laughs> is but one example. Well, I think I've been talking too much. I hope I've been able to give you some sort of insight into modern organ construction and that we might meet again when we can feed and water another pet subject of mine. <laughs>